Hey guys, it's Ethan here from Akimbo Automation. I wanted to give you guys another tip video like the mini chat one because I saw many of you guys actually found it helpful, which was really nice to hear. So what I want to talk about today is AI chatbots. Specifically, if you're building a chatbot and you've probably come across this video about from Liam Otley where he teaches you a method to create an AI chatbot for free and it involves like three three steps, which is creating a replit backend and connecting it to ChatGPT and then connecting it to VoiceFlow and then you can implement it on your website. So that's probably what you've done. So at this point, I'm assuming you've done all this and you've had the replit template installed here. But what you may be struggling to do is to keep it running all the time. And for me, what I had found was when I would out hit run, and then I'd go and like test out the new bot, right? So I'd go to run the bot, but then I'd just get failed to create a new thread. And I was like, how come I have to go and hit run every single time in order for the chatbot to work? Because that was only when it would work. And then I figured out this way. I was looking, I was saying like, should I put in a code that pings it so that it constantly stays running? And I wanted like the cheapest alternative to make this work. And essentially what I found is that the when you do this, the link that you're going to be entering in here that it's instructed on the video, well, you see, it's the developer link. And that's where the problem kind of lies. So you have to keep start here and chat at the end there. But you see how this is developer link? Because it's the developer link, this will mean that it's like in a testing phase so in order for it to work, you have to hit run. In order to counteract that, you need an app link. An app link you get by actually deploying the code. So if you go to your replit, you probably have all this, like the functions, the knowledge. And instead of having to hit run all the time, what you could do is you could go to the deployment section and pick out the best one for you. There's like three options. I think I did the auto deployment and it's really cheap it's really cheap so once you have that auto deployment done it's going to give you this domain here for example and basically what you can do with this here is go back to voice flow and enter that app link and because it's an app now it'll be running 24 7 so you no longer have to go and hit run every time that way it offers a permanent solution for your website and that's basically what I wanted to talk about. So if this video helped at all, let me know. And if there's any questions, I'd love to get back to you. But good luck to that and hopefully that solves the problem.